I'm Laurie de Zangramel. I've been a sculptor for over 40 years and I've done a lot of sculptures in my life, public, public works, uh, Lancelot Capability Brown and Hammersmith and Virginia Woolf for Richmond. I, I love the historical aspect of this and I think that each sculpture tells its story and each sculpture project is an opportunity to discover a whole new world. Like I knew very little about the Royal Society for the Protection of Birds other than having gone to sanctuaries myself and enjoyed that aspect of conservation uh, in the UK. So for me, it's Emily Williamson and a bird. It shows that rapport. And I want people to feel that connection with, oh, this woman, she's here, she's got a bird in her hand. Who is she? Why is she here? And that she should be an approachable figure that somebody can kind of relate to. Emily Williamson was an accomplished woman who created a remarkable initiative, which has resulted in, you know, bird rights and all the rest of it being protected. So she, along with many other women, deserve that recognition in the public sphere, which is public artwork. There's nothing worse than just plain, like, sit there, you know, dead st statuary. You want something that's a bit very alive. And so I think that it sh the, the, she's holding this bird, you see the relationship between her and a bird, and, the, you know, the, she's got her hand lifting her skirt a tiny bit, just, you know, to give some movement to it. And, yeah, hopefully people will be able to relate to that simplicity. I'm a feminist. And I, a feminist doesn't mean that I don't like men and that I don't like, you know, statues of men or anything like that. I just feel we have very much a huge underrepresentation problem in, in worldwide in statuary. And so this is a chance to redress that. And I think that that's what it's about for me and my involvement. I, I have however many years of working life left. I'm hoping that I will be able to do lots and lots of sculptures of women. Um, not because men don't deserve it, but you know, they've, they've, there's plenty of them all out there already. Why would somebody want to vote for mine? I think because it's super simple. It's just Emily Williamson and a bird. That kind of sort of tells the story enough, in my opinion. You can overthink it. It can get more complicated than that. I think it's just appealing and, and timeless, hopefully. For me, it's just about that female representation side and for this opportunity to celebrate a woman of achievement.